Hello, I'm Mike Dorena, President of MD Plastics. We were formed in 1999 to provide the industry with plasticating unit components. We have been very innovative, and our products are designed to increase your productivity. Myself and my staff have been involved in plasticating components since the early 80s. And we are designing a series of videotapes to explain our products and services in more detail. Hopefully you'll find something of interest in here and we'll have a chance to meet with you someday to discuss your application. Thank you very much. We'd like to begin with the discussion of melt preparation and the art of injection molding. We show four of our products that are designed to increase productivity on the plant floor. We'll give a brief description of each product and the subsequent videos follow up with more detail. We think, however, there's a big difference between theory and practice or reality on the plant floor and we want to show you how we, our products provide solutions to bridge the gap. In theory, the GP screw that is supplied by the OEM with the molding machine will produce quality molded parts over the full range of the published stroke or swept volume. In reality, we think that the injection screw will only produce good parts underneath the curve and therefore this range falls between 30 and 70 percent of the swept volume of the screw and the GP screw may not be able to produce melt quality good enough to mold parts in a precision molding range. Solution is the PosiMelt screw. PosiMelt delivers a more thoroughly melted and homogenized product which broadens the process window and allows the molder to produce quality molded parts within the precision molding range and mold parts in the lower residence time and the higher residence time areas. In theory, the GP screw that is supplied will be able to produce quality molded parts without the use of excessive back pressure and high melt temperatures. In reality, however, in order to produce quality molded parts within the precision molding range, excessive amount of back pressure and melt temperature is required with most GP screws. We provide a solution by separating the coordinate system of the flight pitch and the root to expose more resin to the barrel wall for better conductive heat transfer and we disrupt the flow for increased melt homogenization. This is the theory behind the posi melt design. The result is a low volumetric compression ratio with a high linear depth ratio, the depth between the feed and the meter, which delivers a cooler and more thoroughly melted and mixed polymer without the need for high back pressures. Feeding or solids conveying is a very important component on how a screw processes. Theoretically, there should be a differential between the surface of the barrel and the surface of the screw. In reality, today's barrels have a very smooth ID surface finishes and are very similar to screws, therefore retarding solids conveying or feeding. In order to combat poor and erratic feeding, we offer barrels with special surface finishes in order to maximize feeding and output. Theoretically, screw tips shut off quickly and consistently without the need for post-recovery melt decompression. The reality is, however, that there's a pressure differential across every valve inside the barrel. This pressure differential means that a lot of valves don't shut off quickly or consistently. That's the reason why most people use melt decompression, that is to change the pressure differential. We've addressed this problem with the MD performance valve. The MDP valve has the lowest pressure drop in the industry. We've replaced the traditional retainer with a series of tungsten carbide roller bushings. This gives us a very small differential between the front face of the ring and the rear face of the ring. We guarantee it has the best shutoff in the industry. This picture describes the molding cycle. We're assuming that melt pressure is low enough, nozzle tip design and temperature are appropriate for the resin being processed so that when the mold opens, drilling will not occur. In reality, molders struggle with drilling and stringing every day. The industry answer to date is either to one, use melt decompression, which causes melt inconsistency and surface imperfections, or two, to supply a shut-off nozzle that is problematic and very expensive. 
We provide a solution with our mini shut nozzle tip. The mini shut nozzle tip is a completely functional automatic shut off tip that fits in most two piece nozzle body. We can eliminate drooling and stringing without the need for melt decompression. One tip can process most resins with no need for multiple designs. There's easy color material changes and the screw and clamp can operate simultaneously. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about our products for injection molding. If we are fortunate enough to become your vendor, I think you'll see we understand resins, the process, and our products will bridge the gap between practice and theory, allowing your company to become more profitable.